morning, family. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Okay, I've come on today to do a video on some high-end girly gadgets. Now, first, before we get started, let me start off by saying that today is February the 9th. It is 9.58 in the a.m. And we can ready to get started. We're going to talk about some girly stuff. And I have a whole table of stuff. I put the picture up on my Instagram, my Facebook, my Twitter, and my Tumblr. Um, the, that information is below. So if you guys want to go through and subscribe um, to my social media, you're free to do so. So anyway, we're going to get started, okay? But we're going to go from the inside out. Um, and so these are just all of my um, girly beauty treatment gadgets. Um, that I wanted to share. Now, first, let me start off by saying that I'm not endorsed by any company. These are products that I have purchased for myself, for my own personal use. Um, as, you, as you see, I'm a woman of color and this is how it works on my skin. Um, I am 44 years old. I weigh 184 pounds as of this morning. I am 5'5". Five five. And my blood type is O positive. So, and I live an alkaline 80-20 most of the time lifestyle. Okay. So, that just gives you a little small synopsis about me and um, how this is working on me. Everybody's system is different. Everybody, um, you know, they, they, they system do things other way than other people. So, you know, this is just my own personal opinion. So, we're going to call this to be subjective. Okay, this is my personal opinion on how these things are working for me. So I'm going to start off with the beginning of it, though, and I'm going to talk about the main supplements that I take um, to also aid in um, my beauty treatments and such. Now, what I did not do is I didn't bring my biotin over here. Ain't that crazy? I do take 10,000 um, um, units of... Uh, a biotin a day and I didn't bring that over here but I did bring my collagen um, I take this and I also take a one day vitamin for women um, it just kind of goes without saying it's just staples that you should be taking anyway if nothing else you should be taking a multivitamin every day because me personally I don't eat right sometimes and to keep me just on an even keel you know, I rely on my vitamins to take me there when I have fallen short. So, those are the first things that I take. So, now we're going to start off with our hair. Now, um, for years, you guys know my hair was thinning. My hair was thinning like crazy. But, um, now that I'm kind of getting past the, the depression and different things that I was going through, now I found that my hair has begun to thicken up. And one thing that I used when my hair was thinning a lot, and which I've, I've done a video on it before. Once again, I'm not endorsing no uh, soul products per se. I'm not totally putting their name and nothing like that out there. But these are just some of my um, personal goods. Um, but I did do um, LED red light treatments. Let me see if it um, if it'll show. I don't know if it'll show on the screen, the red. Um, but um, I would just simply you know, um, run it through my hair, you know, through my scalp, so to say. And, um, you know, I would get the red light treatment and, you know, I would just hold it in different areas, you know, around, you know, wherever you're having your thinning going on. And I have to say that this did work. Now, um, what, where I got this concept from was I had paid money and I was going down there and you guys remember I was doing videos on it and it should be in my beauty treatments of color. Um, playlist. Um, I was going and I had did a series of 10 um, um, red light treatments and stuff, laser treatments for my thinning of my hair. So I have to say now that I'm eating a little bit cleaner most days that and with the biotin and my vitamins and things of that, that yeah, my hair is thickened up and you know, it's good to go. So, you know, yeah, that works. Now, um, what I cleanse my face with, um, my skin is very sensitive. I am prone to breakouts like right now. Um, you know, uh, I had done, you know, real stupid knowing that my skin is very sensitive. But, you know, I began to, 
you know, you, I told you guys that I had a, a when I had went and got a microdermabrasion, the esthetician had put um, some um, acetone on my skin and had cleansed it first. It worked real good. But when I got home and now I'm trying to do microdermabrasions at home on my own, then I was putting that acetone on there. And I'm like, wait a minute, hold up. Wait, wait a minute, you know your shit can't really, you know, tolerate no acetone like that. So it kind of burned me pretty good. And plus, I had did the microdermabrasion too, so then that also sloughs off the, you know, the top layer and all that. So, you know, I'm kind of on the tail end now of my breakout, but I had a little breakout going on for a minute. But this is what carries me through. I always use a mild um, moisturizing cleanser for my skin, and this is just one of the ones that I use to cleanse my skin. Now, um, my serums. Uh, my girl Loretta, my big sissy, um, had sent um, me this, and I love it. And it's like about this much um, down to, and I love this stuff. I don't know where she got it from, but oh my God, it has my, my skin just very silky smooth, and I love this serum. This is, man, and what's so cold about it, you only use a little bit, and a little bit goes a long way. But now that I found that I got this other little gadget I'm about to show you in a minute. It just amps this up a notch or two. Now, um, I use that, but, oh, before, wait a minute, hold up. I'm still on my cleanse and stuff. Hold up, hold up. Go, we got to go back. And I don't want to edit this video because it's too much problem for me. So let me just go back a little bit because I'm still on my cleansing regimen. Can I go back for a second, girls, please? Okay, we're going to we're gonna do this straight through. We ain't going to cut nothing. We ain't going to do none of that shit. We're going to go straight through, okay? All right. Now, um, when I use my mild cleanser, I use my Clarisonic, okay? This right here, oh, my God. This is the business. It's waterproof, all that. This is the bomb. And it's that, you know, that ultrasonic, the sonic waves. And those sonic waves... It's something to that. Now, whenever you see sonic waves on, on toothbrushes and different things, them sonic waves, y'all might want to, you know what I'm saying, take heed to that sonic thing because they own something with that. And this is my Mia 2, and um, this retails for about $249, and this is one of the best of the best for me. I love it. It cleanses my face way far much more better than me just doing this right here. And then, too, with washcloths, you know, washcloths carry all kind of other shit on them. You know what I'm saying? You done hit one thing, now you're trying to hit the face with it. It don't go together. You know what I'm saying? So, then therefore, if you're going to use washcloths and things on your face, then therefore, I would say have just a washcloth just for your face. Don't use that and you done wiped other things and now done, you know what I'm saying, done wiped your face now with it. You might not want to do that. You know what I'm saying? That might be another contribution to some breakouts is you using the same washcloth on two or three different things and you ain't supposed to be doing that. So, yeah, so Mia 2, Claire Sonic, my shit, boom. Now, now I'm going to go into my, my big sissy, Loretta, sent me this serum that's off the chain, bomb, there it is. Then I come through, this is my tried and true. I have rocked with this brand for many, many a year. This has got me through and got me over. I've got all kind of scrubs and cleansers and um, I even got the thermal mask, all that of this brand right here, and it is absolutely off the chain. I'm going to ask that you look it up. I'm not bullshitting you. I'm not here trying to endorse no product. Let me just go and say that. But a woman of a particular age, and I have used my fair share of products. Now, I'm not a good makeup girl because I'm not good at it. You know what I'm saying? I'm just not good at it. Let me just go and tell you. Eyelashes be crimped up, twisted to the left. I'm not good on the makeup thing, how y'all do it. So, I'm good on my skin thing, on my body thing, on my internal thing. That's where I'm good at, so that's where I'm going to roll with, you know? So, I'm going to let y'all do y'all on the lace fronts and this, 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 and the makeup and the banana powder and all that, and I'm going to watch your thing because I need some tips. So, I'm going to watch y'all on that, but then if y'all could just watch a chick like me on what it is that I do and how I do mine, no. That's all I'm saying, subscribe. <laughs> So, anyway, but yeah, this right here is the bomb. So, and then upon using this, I came upon this. Now, if you got dark spots, age spots, any kind of thing that you want to clear up off your skin, I'm going to ask from the same maker of this, they got this. 
And this is the business. Do you understand me? This right here will get you there, clear you up. Only thing is, right now, I'm coming off the back end of a breakout. So I can't really do it like that right now. But when my shit is all the way on some homeostatic situation, then yeah, I can do this right here. The business, let me turn around to the front. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah, Tone Perfecting Cream. You might want to look that up. And one thing I found, now Rite Aid is high as hell when it comes out of this right here. You're going to pay them their $30 for these ones right here. And then they want to get you get you with some buy one, get one half off plus. You're going to get $10 worth of what you call it bucks if you go over $30. They already know it's going to be over $30. You know what I'm saying? But when you take off all those deductions plus you don't use your coupon, you look real good at going right on to uh, Walmart or Target. And it's cheaper there than it is going to be at Rite Aid, CVS, or something like that. Unless you're carrying over some extra care bucks or you're carrying over and rolling over, you know, your up rewards and things of that nature. But on some regular circumstances type shit, bitch like me, it's called the commissary. This right here is $13.99. This right here, $14.99 commissary. Holla at your partner. Now that's my two for 30. Okay, so when I use those... Girls, listen, let me tell you something. When they came out with this motherfucker right here, let me tell you something. Now, I know that we on some beauty thing, right? We ain't supposed to be coming all sideways and to the left and nothing like that, but I'm your partner, I'm your sister, I'm your girl. I can't come no other way than what I am on this is what's happening. This, this is the Janu Plus, Okay. I endorsed by the company. I don't even know why I said the name, but I had to go ahead on and fell out my mouth. You know what I'm saying? This right here, though, and you can store it. This is how I store it. Plugged up, and it just sits right there. It posts up. It just leans up like that. When you plug it in, it don't go nowhere. Now, right now, it's tripping, but when you plug this up, it just sits up right here like this right here, and it don't... Do you know how, like, some things, like with your cell phones and things... If you can break the charge in them, if you be plugging them up when it ain't time to do it, apparently that don't apply to this right here because it said in the paperwork. You can still do this right here, and it's, it ain't going to mess it up or nothing of the kind. So I've just been doing it according to them. Now, if it, if it jack up, trust and believe I'm going to come see about you. I'm going to send it back. If it, if it start tripping on my charge and all that kind of stuff, I know how to uh, notify a customer service. I know how to do that, okay? Now, this right here is going to cost you. Okay, two hundred and fifty plus dollars. But this right here is gonna make all of these work at an optimal level. These right here, yeah, they're gonna work good when you put them in bop, 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 bop. Cause you got to get the deglate. You got to get this neck and all this right here. When you get all of this and you rub it all in right here, like this right here, with your hand, you're only getting say maybe 10 to 15 percent of the product when you come through with this girl right here this is the activating what you call it you take this right here and what is it called conducting gel okay you're gonna put just a little bit on here about a you know pearl size amount right here on the tip of this after you done wash done all that you needed to do now you finna Go ahead on and seal the deal with this right here. Gonna make everything work perfect, okay? Then you take this, you put this, you put this right here on here, and then you cut it on. This is what it look like. They have the ones that are gray, and they also have the ones that are white. Those are the, the first models. This is the plus version. So the plus version came out with gold, and it's supposed to work uh, six times more better than the white or the silver. So that's why this one is gold. So when y'all get to look at it up, be like, wait a minute, why some of them white? Well, the ones that are white are the first versions, and this one right here is the latest version, and it's supposed to be a little bit more, you know, work a little bit more better or potent or whatever than the other one. But still, it's still all the same. It's still going to work better than doing this right here, bottom line. Now, when you cut it on, it go for one minute. Then you put the product on here, and then you just go over your face with it. I also hit my lips. Okay? I have no injections, no nothing like that. This is just my get down. But, you know, I hit my lips with this. Got to. Because 
it, oh my God. When I used it the first time, it was like overnight. Now, at the time, it was during my major breakouts. My skin was just raw. It was just, oh my God. It was, it was just very, very sensitive and everything. I used this right here the next morning. It seemed like some of those little bumps, you know, the, you get those little breakout high type thing. All that was smoothed out. It felt good. I was like, oh my God, what's going on? Wait a minute, hold on now. What's going on? It was a whole different get down. This right here, do not play. I'm going to tell you right now, it's worth its weight in gold. Put the shit on layaway. Find out what you need to do. If you're ever able, it don't matter what product you use. If you're using Mary Kay, Avon, you're using some shit you bought from Dollar Tree, you're using Noxzema and some, you know what I'm saying, some regular 99 cent store only shit. Whatever your get down is, whatever your budget is, when you use this, it's going to make it work like you done got that shit from Neiman Marcus. That's just how tough this is. Now, one other thing that I use on my skin is this girl right here. This baby don't play either. I use this every other day. This is the bomb. Now, this also got its own little conducting gel that you got to use with it or it ain't going to work the same. This right here. Now, I be, before I put on my serums and stuff, I should have talked about this first. But it don't matter. It don't matter because you don't use this every day. You only use this a certain days out the week. So every other day is when I rock this right here. I ain't do it today. Not yet. I'm going to do it later on tonight. After I've gotten done with my workout, my sauna treatment, and all that other kind of stuff. Then, as my nightcap, I always get down with this. Auntie, do it hurt, do it grab at you, do it sting, what it do? Well, when you cut this on, it's also set for a certain amount of time. I think it's set for like two minutes. Uh, um, no, is it set for two or three minutes? Probably so, I don't know. But anyway, when you're using this right here on the clean, on this, con this conducting gel... Now, it's before you use your moisturizers and serums. This is just after you've cleaned your skin, okay? Now, and you're going to take this and you're going to rake it up the skin. And when you do that, you're going to stop. You see that beat? Then, you're going to take it and you're going to go up again. And it's going to stop. You stop. There it is. And then, you're going to take this up in here like this right here. And you're going to stop. Message has been received. There it is. And you're going to hit net, deglate, all that. And you're just simply toning your skin. I'm not talking about toning the, the, the skin color. I'm talking about toning it as far as bringing the elasticity back in your skin. As you begin to age, you know, your skin and gravity and all that stuff, even though black don't crack, I got all that, okay? But still, you still want to have good hygiene and good beauty treatment regimens to just ward off some shit. I mean, let's just face it, you know, just to, just to stay up and going and just to stay in the game and just to stay about your woman and about your ladyhood, baby, I, I, I wouldn't want to be nothing else but a woman. All this is right here. This is my tilt. This is my thing. This is how I get down. I love this right here. I am in my element right here with all this right here. This is me. Now, also, a good serum that I've used on my eyelashes. Now, I went to Mexico. I had the Mexico knockoff Latisse work bomb as hell. I did open this up. Okay. Now, this right here, this is number seven lash serum. The best in the game. I went through. I, I, I tried different kinds. Rapid lash. All kinds. This one right here, though. Yeah. It's the bomb. It's the bomb. Let me go ahead and hit me a little bit on this since I'm all cleaned up and everything. You know what I'm saying? Because I just took me a shower. You know what I'm saying? And uh, so, yeah, I usually just hit this after I've cleansed and everything. And I just hit that a little bit and I'm gone. That's it. That's what's happening. But this, oh, my God, from wearing individuals. I was wearing the old clunk, clunk individuals back in the day with the lash tight. When they, when your lashes come out, it bring out everything. Then I had to get, because at the beginning I started off in my 20s wearing a strip. So that let y'all know strips and shit been around for a long time. Eyelashes and shit ain't nothing new. My mama was rocking, okay? So, but when I started wearing them in my early 20s, 
I was wearing the long strips. Okay, the long strips is all good. But when they begin to come off, you taking your lashes off with them. Then they came through about maybe 10 years ago. And sister was wearing the clumps. You know, the clump uh, uh, individuals with that, excuse me, lash type black ass glue that you get from Sally's or whatever. Put it in that, dab it on that, and there it is. And it's like a fan, like three little things that fan out like that. And you put them on there. Did that, okay? But when them son of a bitches come out, they come out and bringing everything. They they grabbing on the friends and everything. They taking some of the lashes with them, had me toe up. So I had to go back to my um, strips to allow my eyelashes to thicken up. That's what brought this right here on to allow my lashes to thicken up and get more condition. So now I went back to my minks. Okay, now I ain't got none on right now. You know, since I'm adjusting your screens, I ain't got no mix nothing on right now. But trust me, before the spring and thing, I'm gonna be all the way on deck. It's just the fact that I'm under construction. I'm working on me. I'm trying to get a little muscle tone and thing up. You know what I'm saying? Get my skin and thing right. After I get all that done, then I'm gonna be back on this thing right here. I mean, back on my minks and things, but I'm just not, I can't do it right now. Now, one thing that I do have also that I haven't tried yet, I just took it out the box, box over there, is a red light wrinkle treatment. Um, I'm not to the point of wrinkles or nothing like that, but I got it at a good-ass amazing deal, and I just went on and I bought it, and there's something that's just in my booty, my beauty boudoir, you know what I'm saying? And so, um, if ever I ever need it, I already got one. So this is a light treatment, red light treatment, for wrinkles and such. I can't do no thing on it because I ain't never used it. This one, this right here is my microdermabrasion kit. Um, it has, um, when you open it up, it has the wand when you cut him on and then you just going across the face like that, okay? All up under here, right here. And You know what I'm saying? You don't want to get close to the eye because it's kicking out diamond dust out of here. You know what I'm saying? So then, therefore, you get something in your eye, you be toe up, you know. I wear contact lenses, got a little stigmatism. So, you know, I already know I can't go too close in, but I do kind of hit around the orbital just a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Close my eyes and hit up under there a little bit. Just, you know what I'm saying? But this is the lick. I do love it. It got me together. It's just the fact that I started doing some dumb shit in the, in the meantime and in between time. Told my shit up. Now I'm trying to get it back together. You follow so, anyway, I just wanted to come in, white click girls, show you guys some of my beauty um, high-end treatments and what I use to get my skin to do what I need it to do. And I think this is where it starts, you know. You can put all the makeup on your face that you want to. I ain't, hurt, I ain't hating on my girls that wear all the makeup. You know what I'm saying? To each his own. You know, some people like makeup. Some people are into their hair. Some people are into, you know, just a, a clean canvas but they want it flawless though i will be in that line i have much respect for you guys to do what you guys do i need to learn some steps from you guys just as you guys might learn two or three things from me so it's share and share alike and sisters supporting sisters and on that note girls i'm out i love you guys i love you guys for watching you guys stay up and stay pretty talk to you soon bye